ass poking. Bitch, like, is it out? Like, bitches, we good? <sighs> oh, bitches, we good. So I look slenza. So I look cozy. And do the cozy by far. Good pussy. The cons of having good pussy. Oh, the cons of having good pussy. <laughs> Y'all could even Balenciaga hear the baddest bitch on YouTube, Kalaja Queen herself. You ain't never seen a bitch like me on the YT. I bitch is back and it feels so good to be back on YouTube for good. From this week on out, you all will get at least one video a week. I know I've been missing it. Oh, my hat is slipping. I know I've been missing. I know I really have been missing. And I know I have a lot of making up and explaining to do. And we going to get to all that. But first today, um, I wanted to talk about the topic, good pussy, the cons of having good pussy. I wanted to talk about this because this is honestly why I was missing. Like a bitch was in hiding. Like niggas was trying to track me down and shit. Like girl, let's get into it. About eight months ago, maybe nine, maybe 10. Now sure though. Remember I had moved to Los Angeles. And when I moved to Los Angeles, my original plan was to be out here in my bag get my coins you know we like to be you know coined up in this camp you know we love coin we love money money makes the world go wild money make the pussy go true true and not only was i here for the money but i was also you know i had to have a new experience of, of life you know explore take hikes stuff like that you know adventurous wild bitch rawr. that was my original plan but when i got out here niggas wanted to start acting crazy and when i say that niggas start sliding in my they start sliding my dms okay and that's where the good pussy that's where this this is why i was missing just follow along follow along i got here and um one day i was just randomly on instagram and i got this dm from this dude or whatever and i had recognized the name because i had seen him in the name that i see his i seen his name in the credits of interviews and the credits of movies um this dude was an actor and he was a fine actor he was actually probably your favorite actor okay but we won't spill too much tea on that so he slides in my dms with the hey emojis and i would have been a stupid bitch if I would have just you know like straight up ignored him would you ignore him no especially if you knew who he was because he was finding a bitch okay so I was like hey how you doing me and him get to talking and immediately I'm like bitch I'm about to get sidetracked I'm supposed to be out here in my bag but these niggas is fucking with me these niggas is fucking with me and I'm gonna start fucking with these niggas especially fine ones I don't know a bitch on this earth that just turned down a fine I just don't you ain't my type of bitch if you just turn down fine ass niggas for a living okay we got to talking and outside of being him being fine i can honestly say he was a real good dude he was very nice he was a gentleman he was everything that you wanted in a dude but there was this one quality that i did not like about him and that was the fact that he was obsessive obsessive nigga plus good poo nah nah equals a disaster he didn't even know i had good pussy and he was already obsessed like, but, but, uh, Mariah said the best. Why are you so obsessed with me? Boy, I want to know. And then before you get the pussy. At least make it after you get the pussy if you get obsessed. I understand that. I still ignore the fact that he was so obsessive and I was still talking to him. And it was like three weeks had gone by. He was, he was doing everything right. He was being a little gentleman. And he had ended up getting the poo Now, Well, originally, when he had got the poo Now from me, he had came in like 3.5 seconds. But like five minutes, like we went for round two and he lasted. I understood. He ain't got his rocks off in a long time. He ain't had no pussy like this bitch. He didn't even know what he was in for. But I let him in for some more. And when I let him in for some more, that that's when that's right there right there at that very moment that's when i had fucked up when i let him get this pussy more than twice that's when i fucked up he kept coming back every night and i'm talking about this a book nigga we love a book nigga this a book nigga but he was gonna make time for this pussy and he made time for this pussy and his obsessiveness got worse it got real dark i'm talking about some I wake up in the morning, look outside the window, looking for the little birds and the little chirpings and shit. And I look and see this nigga in his car waiting for me. Nigga, it's two hours till I gotta be to work. Like, what else go on? He ended up getting me fired from my job, y'all, because he would show up at my job unannounced. It just got real ridiculous. And I honestly have to go and hide. And that mean no YouTube videos. That mean no posting on social media. That mean, bitch, I need to delete these accounts, okay? Because I don't want him to know where I'm at. It had gotten so bad, I had to go to the police. Good pussy make the nigga go choo choo. This is why he was obsessed. This this why he was so obsessed. This why he was obsessed. Right here. 
this why he was upset because I was so that shit back like that boy take that pussy take that pussy boy y'all when you got good pussy you know how to throw the pussy bitch that make it even worse the nigga had me bouncing like this all the time he always want the fuck girl he had me checking on the punana like this I was checking on the punani, I'm like, you okay, girl? I had to talk to the punani. You okay, girl? She warring back, but she ain't even warring no more. She was going, mm -hmm. I know, I know good pussy make niggas do things, but I have never been in a situation where niggas come just, 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 just take the pussy. Just, don't just take, how you just gonna take the pussy? Like, I had to get out of order, I, I, what a sign for this nigga for him to know that my pussy was tied. I mean, I, I, my pussy got mouths, but bitch, you adding my ledge. Yeah, does anybody get what I'm saying? He was adding my ledge to my pussy, and my it was became it was becoming worn, it was worn out. I worn. I need to. I need pussy rejuvenation. Girl, he had lips hanging. You okay, baby? She got rejuvenated. She good. He just beat, just beat the pussy up, up, up. Like I had to call on pussy warriors. You know, you, you say you pussy prayer. Just so my pussy, I, my pussy had to know what she was in for. And something was wrong with this man. I eventually had ended up going to the police or whatever, getting restraining order. All that shit got clear. He got to stay away from me. If he come near me, I can fuck him up. But yeah, that's one of the cons of having good pussy. And um, that's 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 where I was. I was I was in hiding. I hope you believe that. Good pussy and the cons of having good pussy. All my ladies out there that got the good poop now, now comment some more cons of having good pussy down below. If you ever had an obsessive nigga after you or whatever, comment down below. I would love to know. I'm getting hot in here with this fur, so I'm about to go take off all my clothes. I'm trying to give an effect on camera, and I'm hot. So I'll talk to y'all later. Um, Stay classy. That's classy and that's ratchet. Bye. Leave that bitch alone and get